friends welcome to civil engineering exam today we are going to see the mcq related with building construction technology in the topic of building components so the first question the angular steps used for changing direction of stairs are called option a round steps option b angular steps option c winders option d radial steps so the correct answer is option c winders so next question the platform at the end of the series of steps is known as option a relief option b landing option c platform option d rest so the correct answer is option b landing so next question exposed portions of vertical surface at right angles to the door or window frame are known as option a lintels option b rivels option c soffits option d jams so the correct answer is option b rivels next question The opening provided in sloping roof with its top parallel to the roof surface is called option A skylight window option B lateral window option C lowered window option D dormer window so the correct answer is option A skylight window next question the vertical side member of shutter frame is known as option A style option B rivel option C mullein option D post the correct answer is option A style The next question the vertical member running through the middle of the shutter frame is option A style option B rivel option C mullein option D post the correct answer is option C mullein next question the vertical members fixed between steps and handrail are known as option A strings option B novel post option C soffits option D balusters so the correct answer is option D balusters next question the projection of head or sill of the door or window frame or option a horns option b stops option c chocks option d transoms so the correct answer is option a horns next question a floor constructed with the 4 to 6 mm marble chips is known as option a mosaic floor option b marble floor option c terrazzo floor option d reinforced marble floor the correct answer is option c terrazzo floor next question in flat roof of reinforced cement concrete the recommended angle of slope is option a a few degrees option b 0 option c 10 degree option d 20 degree the correct answer is option a a few degrees next question crown is located at option a skew back of the arch option b highest point of the intradoss of the arch option c highest point of the extradoss of arch option d none of the above So the correct answer is option C highest point on the extradoss of the arch. Next question the members which support covering material of sloping roof are option A rafters, option B purlins, option C battens, option D struts. The correct answer is option A rafters. Next question the minimum width of the stairs in residential building is option A 60 mm, option B 70 mm, option C 90 mm. option d 110 mm the correct answer is option c 90 mm next question the vertical faces of the door opening which support frame of the door are option a jams option b post option c reveals option d styles the correct answer is option a jams next question the highest line of sloping roof where two opposite slopes meet is known as option a rafter option b crown option c ridge option d eave The correct answer is option C ridge. Next question, the vertical side of the door and window openings provided in a wall are known as option A verticals, option B reveals, option C jams, option D none of the above. The correct answer is option C jams. Next question, a tire should not have pitch more than option A 25 degree, option B 35 degree, option C 45 degree, option D 55 degree. The correct answer is option C 45 degree. So next question the window which projects outside a roof of building for admitting more light and air is known as option A bay window option B casement window option C lattern window option D dormer window. The correct answer is option A bay window. Next question the window which is provided on the sloping roof of the building is known as option A lattern window option b dormer window option c lowered window option d casement window correct answer is option b dormer window 
Next question, the ceiling height of the building is option A between ceiling and ground level, option B between ceiling and floor level, option C up to roof above ground level, option D up to ceiling from the ground level. So the correct answer is option B between ceiling and floor level. So next question, the service area in the building means the area occupied by option A stairs, option B bathroom and water closet, option C light and shaft, option D all the above. The correct answer is option D all the above. Next question, the thickness of the mortar bed on which the brick flooring is laid is option A 8 mm, option B 10 mm, option C 12 mm, option D 14 mm. The correct answer is option C 12 mm. Next question, how many components are there in the cement concrete flooring? Option A 2, option B 3, option C 4, option D 5. The correct answer is option A 2. So next question, the minimum thickness of the granolithic finish when laid over a hardened surface is option A 35 mm, option B 25 mm, option C 15 mm, option D any of the above. So the correct answer is option A 35 mm. Next question, the ratio of cement and marble in terrazza is option A 1 is to 4 to 1 is to 3, option B 1 is to 3 to 1 is to 3, option C 1 is to 4 to 1 is to 2, option D 1 is to 5 to 1 is to 4. The correct answer is option C 1 is to 4 to 1 is to 2. So next question, the size of the marble chips used in terrazza flooring varies from option A 2 to 4 mm, option B 3 to 6 mm, option C 8 to 10 mm, option D 12 to 15 mm. The correct answer is option B 3 to 6 mm. Next question, dash is the top horizontal part of the frame. Option A rail, option B head, option C shutter, option D style. The correct answer is option B head. Next question, dash is the openable part of the door or window. Option A frame, option B rail, option C shutter, option D sill. The correct answer is option C shutter. So next question, dash is the bottom most horizontal part of the frame. Option A head, option B sill, option C brace, option D style. The correct answer is option B sill. So next question, the minimum area of window should be dash of the floor area in case of public building. Option A 10%, option B 20%, option C 30%, option D 40%. The correct answer is option B 20%. So next question, the panels are fully glassed in a dash window. Option A fixed window, option B sliding window, option C double hung window, option D sash window. The correct answer is option D sash window. Next question, which of the following roof slopes in two direction? Option A lean to roof, option B gable roof, option C hip roof, option D manstad roof. The correct answer is option B gable roof. So next question, the height of the door should not be less than option A 1.2 meter, option B 1.4 meter, option C 2 meter, option D 2.3 meter. So the correct answer is option C 2 meter. Again we will see in next video. Thank you.